Music is extremely important to our local culture. Whether it's a family gathering, in a church, or at Crawfish Day, we're always surrounded by music. I caught up with the members of Black Rose, a local hip-hop group who performed with Autumn High at Crawfish Day, about their place in the local music scene. We have somewhat diverse artists, I guess you could say, but I think we're very, very different from a lot of people. We're so different than any other group down here that it makes it harder for us. We have to put in so much effort and so much other work to prove to ourselves that we're not just a standard, that we're not just a carbon copy, as some would say, of the music down here, because we speak the truth and we're not all glorizing what we don't have. It's more like we're rapping what we know about, but we just put it in such a weird way through our imagination that it kind of works for us. I also found two local bands, Sight and Sound and Rick Flavored Arsenal, celebrating Cinco de Mayo with a show at the Brick House in Homa. I talked to Ripa, the music liaison for the Brick House, about how local bands affect their business. No, we do support local music. Without local acts, you can never have national acts, you know, because that's where they started, you know. Homa's got a lot of talent, uh, a lot of awesome musicians, and tonight was proof. You know, and tomorrow night's gonna be the same thing. Plus, it's all about the music. Everything before and after is a bunch of work. Uh, when the music's playing, it makes all that pain go away. This is what we, it's why we do what we do. If you wanna know why we rock, that's how we roll. Links to music and more from these bands can be found on their individual Facebook pages. To hear more about other local bands, be sure to tune in to 91.5 FM KNSU. So until next time, I'm Brian Bourgeois with the Nichols Insider, but right now it's time to jam. Let's go.